Hey guys, welcome to day two of Virtual VBS. We're so excited that you're here. Um, so I hope that you got to join us yesterday and do lots of the fun and the music and crafts. And so we're gonna do that again today. We'll have story time with Miss Charlotte again and music and another fun craft. So I hope you enjoy. Okay guys, welcome back today. Um, this is day two of our story time and this will be a really short story today. But it's going to, our story is going to be the sheep and coin are found and that's in Luke 15, um, chapters three through 10. So if you wanna look that up, that'd be great. And so basically um, it talks about a shepherd and the shepherd has a hundred sheep and he's out in the, out in the pasture, out in the field, um, tending to his sheep and one of the sheep um, gets lost. One of the sheep runs off. Maybe, you know, has um, his attention span is not that great and so he runs off. And so Jesus makes sure that he goes and he gets the sheep and brings the sheep back to the flock. So no matter what, Jesus is always looking out for us. He loves us and even if we tend to stray away, that he will always bring us back to him. Hey guys, welcome back for day two of VBS with Miss Cassie and Ezra helping me. Um, we're going to start today with a favorite of St. Mark's youth um, and me personally love this song. Uh, you are good. So let's sing it together today and, um, and remember how good God is to us. Even in all this craziness and us not being together, let's remember how good God is to us.
guys, welcome to day two um, of Hey Day VBS. Um, today we are making a sheep out of toilet paper. Um, so, you know, after your sheep is done, if you need some extra toilet paper, you can always just use it. Um, so you should have this in your bag. Um, and uh, we didn't include scissors, but hopefully you have some. And um, if you need help, ask an adult or a parent um, to cut out these shapes on um, the paper. So um, the stencils are on the white paper and you're not going to separate the black and white paper, you just cut over it. Um, so I'm going to do that real quick and um, I'll be right back after I'm done. Okay guys, so I um, cut out the squares of the four black, black squares and I'm gonna save one um, white square to cut out the eyes later um, for the head. Okay, so now I'm gonna be cutting the um, sheep head. And um, yeah. Okay guys, so I just cut out my sheep head and with my white paper, I drew some circles for the eyes. And um, remember that um, we wanna see your sheep, so take pictures whenever you're done and um, send, this, send them to us um, so we can see what you guys did. Um, so I'm trying my best to cut out a circle and it's really, it's diff more difficult than it looks. But um, just don't be afraid to ask for help. And um, you can use whatever uh, utensil you have to just draw on a circle and then draw a smaller circle. Um, in the eye so it looks like an eye um, for your sheep. So um, <laughs> I'm going to um, do that real quick and then um, put the head and the eyes on my toilet paper right in the middle. And um, I'm going to use my glue dots um, that are included that used um, that you're going to use tomorrow, sorry, for your flower pot. Um, so make sure to save those for tomorrow. Um, so I'm just gonna use some glue dots to um, attach my um, head to my toilet paper roll right in the middle. And then I'm going to um, attach my eyes to the face um, with some tape because they're small and the glue dots are kind of big. So, um, if you have tape, use that. If not, you can still use your glue dots, um, but I'm just gonna use some tape to help attach that to the toilet paper roll. Um, okay. I'm putting on my head right now. Um, remember that it goes like right like right above the hole so you can stick it to something, but it'll, the like mouth part will be over the hole so you can't see it. Um, you, you might be wondering what to do with these um, black squares and these are going to be the legs. And um, you might have to cut them because um, it, was, it was falling over earlier when we did it with uh, the length that it was, um, just to keep it sturdier. And also um, we put a sheet of paper under the toilet paper roll so it would stick and it wouldn't uh, fall off because the toilet paper is really thin and it kind of falls off. So, um, okay, okay, good, it's standing up. So what you're going to do with the legs is you're just going to roll them up into tight um, cylinders and um, uh, you can use your glue dots or use some tape again to um, close the um, cylinder with the paper and um, maybe cut it in half so it's just the right length um, so it's sturdy enough and it um, just holds it up good. Um, so I'm just gonna cut this one in half and then um, use a glue dot to put it on and see it's falling over. They're, they're not the strongest, but we're trying. Um, I'm gonna use another glue dot to stick on the bottom of the toilet paper roll um, just to help out and keep it uh, strong and sturdy. Um, 
it's really difficult. So definitely ask for help. This is the hardest craft that you'll definitely be doing. Um, so it's really hard. It's just really hard. Okay, I'm going to stick it to the bottom. And um, I will add three more legs um, with the black squares and I'll be back. Okay guys, so I'm back with the uh, finished product and I added the legs on and um, hopefully it stands up. Um, if not, that's okay. Just take a picture and send it to us. We wanna see what you guys did. And remember that this uh, sheep relates to the parable today that um, Jesus left the 99 to get the one uh, sheep. And remember that he is always there for you and um, doesn't leave anybody behind. So I hope you guys have a good rest of your day and um, don't forget to take a picture. We wanna see, um, bye. Hey guys, I hope you had so much fun today doing, doing your virtual VBS. I know we had so much fun making it for you guys. I hope that you can join us again tomorrow for our last day. Okay kids, bow your heads and pray this prayer with me. Dear God, thank you for your word, the Bible. Thank you for making us special. Help us remember to love one another just as you love each of us. Thank you for your love. We love you, God. Thank you for Jesus. In his name, amen.